Will Toncoin bottom now in advance of any news or real news about what the French are going to do with the Telegram founder? Or is this disturbance in this top 10 crypto going to hurt both the market? And will there be one final puke in Toncoin that gives you the really juicy opportunity to get involved long term? At the end of the day, whatever controversy happens with Telegram is essentially publicity for both Telegram and Toncoin. Of course, we don't, we're not insensitive to the fact that, you know, what's happening to that person who got arrested is both somber and serious. However, for investors, it's highlighting Telegram and Toncoin and making me wonder, where's the bottom? If you need a roadmap in crypto, subscribe to this channel. This show is brought to you by Lux Algo. So we're going to dive right in to the Toncoin two-day chart. So here's why I like Lux Algo. Lux Algo can give you all kinds of interesting levels. Here I'm using the premium discount zone inside Lux Algo price action concepts. So this box right here, this gray box is telling you a couple things. One, Toncoin has reached kind of a balanced zone. So it's not too expensive, not too cheap. It's balanced. It's also found an area where there were large orders before a takeoff back in April. So this zone just above and just below $5 on a high time frame chart is a support point. Now, adding to the constructive case, there's an X signal, which is like an indicator that will show you that momentum to the downside is slowing. Now, the oscillator matrix hasn't put its own bottoming signal in yet. And sometimes with this X signal, you can get one more downward thrust. So the theme of this research is, can there be one more downward thrust in Toncoin before any type of meaningful bottom is put in? Let's switch to the daily chart, okay? Going back to the Black Monday crash, in early August, we can see there was this X signal noting that downside momentum could slow only to see the final crash happen followed by a reversal. Could the same thing happen again? Now on this lower time frame chart, Toncoin is headed for the discount zone, the green zone, in other words, where, you know, this area just below this April low on the daily represents, I don't know, let's call it the juicy level. That's between 479 and 438. Luxalgo's got an additional take profit target of 431. Now, what would make Toncoin go down there? First, Toncoin is at the 38% retracement of its overall trend higher. That level is $5.47. So if Toncoin can't reclaim that level, it is possible that they could do another test to the downside, to the discount zone on the daily chart, and also the bottom of the balance zone on the two-day chart. Lux Algo has put in kind of a sell signal from yesterday, right? From the really big drop in Toncoin. So it's signaling that there could be one more thrust that I know it's like for everybody that missed it on the way up, it's like, ooh, I got to get in right now. But Lux Algo is painting a picture of, yeah, you may want to get in, but it could pay to make them sell it to you at a good price. At a good price could be 481 or 431. Clearly, it seems like the juicy level, the juicy buy in Toncoin is sub $5. And think about it. There are negative seasonals for Bitcoin in September, right? Ethereum doesn't trade well. Again, this disturbance where you had a problem with a top 10 coin seems to have a ripple effect. You get one last down move in this, one last move on, say, some big splashy negative headline, that could be your bottom. Check out the Lux Algo affiliate link in the description down below.